Hi everyone. Today we're going to talk about spark plug fouling. Let's get the engine started. Here's a quick tip. After you've got the engine started, don't start priming again straight away. Wait until the engine surges and then give it a little bit of prime every once in a while to keep it running fast. We're going to leave the right engine mixture setting set to full reach while we start up the left engine. The right engine is warm enough to run much more smoothly now. One of the changes that I've made with this update is that when an engine is cold, it doesn't just idle at a lower RPM, it also runs more rough. I wait for the engine to surge before I prime again. Keep your eye on the RPM gauge. That last bit of priming was enough, and the engine is now idling without any more help. Now I lean back the left engine mixture. It will help it burn cleaner, and will help it warm up quicker. I'm going to put in a quick break while I warm up the engines. Let's test the magnetos on the left engine. The first thing we do is we bring up the manifold pressure to the field pressure, which is normally around 30 inches. Now we'll test the left and right circuits individually, and we'll look for a small drop in RPM whenever the engine is running on just one circuit. The left engine looks good. When the engine has been idling for a long time, you can always get failed spark plugs, even if you've set the mixture to lean. Once you've finished checking the spark plugs on the engine, idle the engine at about 1500 RPM to keep the spark plugs clean. We've kept the mixture on the right engine rich all this time. Let's run the same checks on it. This time, when we check the magnetos, we get a huge drop in RPM. Spark plugs on both circuits are really fouled up. The plug-in simulates different levels of foul. And the more filled up a circuit is, the longer it takes to clear. When we switch back to both circuits, the RPM picks up again, but the engine still can't deliver full power. When we push the throttle forward the whole way, the manifold pressure doesn't get much above 40 inches. The higher RPMs and hotter combustion clean the spark plugs. When we retest the magnetos, we only get a small drop in RPM. We throttle back to 1500 RPM and now we're ready to take off. We deliberately fouled the spike plugs on the right engine this time, but remember, spark plugs do become fouled when you're idling, sometimes, so always check your magnetos before you take off.